Earlier we had code like this, where we say Renton equals new marker options, we pass it a latitude and a longitude, and we set the title as a string. Now this code set the position and title for the pin, but we can customize this further with another property which is the dot icon property. Here's an example. Now you can see I have the same position, I have the same title, but I'm now using the dot icon property and I'm setting that to a bitmap descriptor factory dot from resource. And as you may recall from Android Fundamentals, when you use a bitmap descriptor factory dot from resource, you can then define a resource as an or dot drawable. And I'm just using the basic or.drawable.ic launcher, which is the default icon that comes with Android Studio projects. And it's an icon of a little Android himself. So just to keep things simple, I'm not adding a new icon to this application. I'm not adding a new icon to this sample. I'm just using one of the ones that's built in. You can, of course, add your own graphics as drawable resources and use them here. And in fact, I would recommend it because using the little Android icon as a pin, as you'll see in a moment, isn't the most user-friendly way of doing it.